Well, BDR uh, has been working at the club in Miami with, with Dallas and the rest of the guys um, and the kid. And, uh, and then uh, Dallas and the kid take off and that's where we pick up the movie. Um, so in the interim, after Mike leaving, uh, you know, BDR has somewhat become the, the you know, the, the interim lead singer. So it's a bit like having the drummer step up and, and take over vocals for your band while the lead singer's gone. So, uh, you know, obviously once we get Mike back and get the band back together, he's happy to give up the, give those reins back up. I mean, each character has their own flavor and their own arc and their own thing, you know, uh, much, much like a boy band, <laughs> you know. <laughs> they all have different personalities and different voices that are very unique from each other. Um, you know, everybody has their thing, that's, that, that, that has their note that they play that's just, you know, impeccable and, and different from each other. You know, obviously, you know, Channing, Mike is this unbelievable dancer um, and just, you know, so incredible to watch and, and just head and shoulders you know, probably the best dancer I've, I've, I've ever seen. You know, and then you've got Ken, who turns out to be this amazing singer. And, you know, I, I've gone, I went to drama school with Matt, so I've been, I've heard him sing for the past, you know, 20 years. So I knew he could do that, but it's, it's going to be amazing for other people to see, you know, him do that. And then also, you know, his Reiki healing and, you know, it's just, he's kind of the, the you know, the granola hippie out of, out of the group. You know, Teresa and Allison and Luke are are amazing. And 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 Allison is, you know, Stephen described her as a genius. And, you know, I hate throwing that word around and I know that he hates throwing that word around, but you know, if you're talking about genius in terms of someone who can create something that didn't exist before, um, that's Allison. I mean, she I mean the routines this time around versus even the ones from last time around. I mean, it's just, it's incredible how she's stepped up the game. And this movie is, you know, people in the theater are going to see, you know, what's it like the cutting edge of dancing? You know, we added Twitch who is absolutely out of his mind, like incredible. And, and he and Chan have this insane routine. Hey there, so you think you know movies. Well, did you know that Beverly Hills Cup was the highest grossing R-rated movie of all time until The Matrix Reloaded claimed the top spot? And another one, did you know that the last line Superman says in Superman 4 is see you in 20 and 20 years later Superman Return was released? Ammazza! That's all for today, I'm Valerie and remember to subscribe to keep up to date on the latest releases.